All right, guys, so today, um, unfortunately, I'm going to be talking about a subject that's pretty popular right now, and that is the banning of the AR-15. Something that's been pretty popular on uh, YouTube and Facebook is the whole idea of one less gun. And um, today, I feel like I need to do my part in that. This is my AR-15 that I built. It is a custom AR-15. It has some um, upgraded internal parts. It has the SSA Geisley trigger group. And um, I just need to make sure that this gun never ends up in the hands of a criminal. This gun is unloaded, by the way. So as the saying goes, a uh, picture speaks a thousand words. So like pictures are as um, thousands of videos. So <clears throat> with a picture being like thousands of words, I hope this video is like thousands of images so as a thousand words is to a picture I hope this video is like thousands of pictures to you guys so here we go this AR versus a chainsaw let's get started Let's do this. Ready, set, go. Now for the AR. And go.
Oops. All right, guys, so um, as you can see, probably the, if you got a lot of trees to cut down, I would probably just stick with a chainsaw. Um, it's a lot more effective uh, as far as time and money. Um, but the AR was way funner. Um, definitely cost a little bit more. Spent about $70 in ammo uh, trying to cut that tree down. And I actually had to use the shotgun to finish it off. So um, again, if you're trying to clear a lot of trees out, um, probably don't use the AR for that. Wait, so you guys didn't actually think I was gonna cut my AR up with a chainsaw, right? So let's talk about this whole one less gun um, topic that's been going around here, okay? So um, I titled this video One Less Gun because this AR right here, this is one less gun that is going to get in the hands of the criminals. And the reason why is because I'm never gonna get rid of this gun, okay? so. Um, for you gun owners out there who are destroying your weapons to try to, you know, prove this point that criminals aren't going to own guns, they are going to own guns, okay? Uh, no matter how many laws are put in place for us law-abiding law citizens um, to not own them, they will always own them, okay? So uh, my advice is instead of destroying your firearms, um, buy as many as you can, okay? Because if you buy 10 or 20 and keep them, it's that many firearms that aren't gonna end up in the hands of criminals, not just one, okay? So um, along that logic, if that's the way you wanna go, uh, buy as many as you can, okay? That makes more sense. It's 20 times, 30 times more effective depending on how many firearms you buy. These guns, guys, uh, with the way America's going and the way our country is headed, these are going to be priceless here pretty soon, I think. So I think it's important to uh, keep fighting for our freedom, especially the Second Amendment. It's there for a reason, okay? The main reason is that the government can't rise up and overtake the citizens of a country. And I find it interesting that even though, if you actually look into it, even though this gun, it is not the main um, weapon of choice for crimes, guys. Not even close, okay? That's what media is wanting you to think. And frankly, anything the media says out there, you gotta take it with a grain of salt because they are absolutely feeding you lies about this kind of stuff, okay? I find it very interesting that this is the gun, this is the type of rifle, I should say, that does uh, somewhat compare to what our military carries. So. I find it very interesting that they are trying to de-arm us of this type of weapon, okay? Because again, the second amendment is there. The main purpose that's there is so um, the citizens of a country don't get overtaken by the government. So anyways, guys, I know that's a hot topic going around, uh, going around. and you know, any pro-gun uh, person out there, you know what the deal is, guys. It's uh, the same old thing we just gotta keep pushing back harder than what they're pushing against us so anyhow till next time you guys be safe out there and we will see you later